We are at a newer, phenomenal, gorgeous facility that just recently opened up in the last couple months. Johnson's Landing, I'm here with Bobby. How are you doing? And uh, tell us a little bit about the facility. You, you just opened up, what, you said like in the last month and a half, two months? August 13th, so Fantastic. we're looking at about a month and a half now. Wow, that is amazing. How have things been uh, going? I, what you haven't seen yet is they have some phenomenal uh, patio space as well as the gorgeous inside that we're in. Yeah, absolutely. So we're a uh, three-story brewery with the roof included. Uh, we have a two different patio setups here. We have two different stories of restaurant full dining. We are up on the upper level and what you all don't see just yet is right over there, gorgeous waterfront view. So this is, you can't beat this. And the inside is stunning. So tell us a little bit about the, the brewing operation, like the setup, some kind of your goal, your yeah. mission. What got, what got so, you guys into this? We have always known restaurant. That has been our background in this family for 20 years over at uh, Peg's Place. So it's been, we've known food and we figured why not take it to the next level and offer something that we haven't done before and that we know that we could possibly make an impact on. So we decided to take on beer. It was one of those things that uh, I went to school for and then we've taken on another brewer as well and we've taken it full, full steam ahead here. The brewery setup is pretty unique and pretty cool yeah. based on how it was constructed around the space. So if you don't mind, tell us a little bit about the brewing setup and some of the, the fun you all had to yeah. get that dialed in. Yeah, so that was, a, that was an interesting process with being in a basement. Um, it's a 10 barrel system. It's actually shipped from Portland. We flew out there, picked it up there, and then we brought it in here and had it custom fabricated by UDMC, uh, which is United Dairy. It's a, it's a, that system is, it's out of this world. It's Beautiful. fully pneumatic. Everything is right from a screen there. There's not a single hand valve on the entire system. It completely reduces the risk of any problems with the beer and hope to produce good product. Beautiful tap set up behind us. About how many beers are you having on tap at any given time, would you say? Or how many are you looking to produce? So currently right now we have five on tap. Okay. Uh, we're looking to keep in a soft spot of six to eight with allowing guest taps to be able to rotate in with seasonal beers and everything like that. Um, we're looking to keep enough volume that we can possibly down the line can our own product and okay. if the possibility presents itself to be able to throw a few kegs around the area. One of my favorites has got to be our uh, Audiel. That beer, is, it's simple, it's easy, it's um, there's not a lot going on in it that makes it too crazy where you can't have more than one glass, but nice. it's, you're able to have a few and you know kick back and enjoy. So Audiel is definitely one of my favorites. Okay. There's a few that we got coming out that I'm, I'm excited to be able to be a part of on that end, but they're gonna be- You can't talk about it right now, I understand. I'll give a hint towards one. Okay. We're looking towards a cookie, cookies and cream style stout, maybe a little bit of nit nitro in there. So we're- uh, Fantastic. Yeah. Not that we want to rush this gorgeous weather. I mean, if you look outside today, I mean, right, it's absolutely. stunning, but tis the season for the darker and the heartier, so personal fan. I saw the gorgeous pizza oven downstairs, yeah. but I want to hear you tell us a little bit about the food concept that you're having because it already seems like you've done your homework on what's going to pair with the delicious libations you, you're all making. Yeah, so with being a restaurant forward family, uh, food comes first. We've said it before, we'll, we'll say it again and we'll say it to everyone that comes in the building. We're food first. We walk in the door, we want you to know that you're going to get a good plate of food and a good beer to go with it. I love what you all are doing here and it's exciting to see this, uh, this taking light, taking yeah. shape. No, it, it was a, if you would have asked me three months ago what this place would have been where it is now, I would have probably laughed at you while I was building tables and chairs. So it's been a, uh, it's been a crazy experience. So we're happy to be where we are now and, you know, serving people of Hamburg.